Neighbors tell 11 News they are nervous and frightened to walk outside. They offer their condolences to the family of 54-year-old Sheila Jones, who died after two pit bulls attacked her Friday. A 67-year-old woman and a 42-year-old man bitten by the dogs are recovering. This is just devastating for the, for the neighborhood. Our kids, you know, they play and we're building like community gardens around here and stuff like that. And now it's like I'm questioning whether or not, it, there's a lot of questions. People not in a good place for them dogs was around here like that. They scare everybody. Jones lived just up the street from where the dogs attacked. One neighbor declined to speak on camera, but tells 11 News what she saw Friday night at the corner of North Pulaski Street and Clifton Avenue in this Mondawmin neighborhood. She says the dogs came out of nowhere. She stood in horror as they mauled Jones and another woman. She says she was too scared to move. I mean, it is sad. It's, it's really sad. And whomever dog that, they, that it belongs to, they need to be accountable for this murder. Other neighbors say they did as police instructed them. They stayed in their homes. I was in my house and I heard the helicopter said, everyone please stay in their homes. So, and the next thing I know, I seen a lot of like flashing lights and stuff. So I just peeked my head out the door. Officers then were able to locate the dogs, corner them um, and discharge their firearm, striking uh, one of the dogs who was then taken by animal control. Now that dog had to be euthanized. The other dog still remains in the custody of animal control. And police say they're trying to figure out who may own the dogs. And they're also working with the state's attorney to determine any possible charges. Reporting live from West Baltimore, Barry Sims, WBAL-TV, 11 News.